This is Dell XPS 15 model, which is P95F. So this one came with Core i9 8 gen processor, which is definitely more than a couple of years old. And recently, the problem with this machine, when you turn on, pins a lot. The CPU or GPU fan, one of them, or could be both, because I, I think there are a couple of fans anyway. So both of them does spin a lot, make a lot of noise, and also sometimes it get disabled the audio, even does have a lot of lag. So now I realized it, I found this sort of case more than 10 within last six months. So I believe the problem from my experience, the problem comes from the operating system or poor cooling system that could be dust, which might lead the thermal paste already dried off. So we're gonna try, we're gonna open up and check the conditions of the thermal paste. If it dried out, we're gonna give it a clean. And then if it doesn't resolve the issue, definitely that is the operating system. And the most funny thing is, only the problem appears along when they try to install Windows 11 in Windows 10, okay? So we're gonna go back to Windows 10 Pro and hopefully that will be resolved. So let's open up and check.
So we have been completed the thermal space application and the thermal space condition was 50-50. Anyway, we cleaned it, we reapplied. To clean it, I used 99.99% rubbing alcohol. By the way, this laptop came with by default Windows 10 Pro, but the previous user, they installed Windows 11. And since then, the problem was started, okay? Uh, might be there are many updates. Uh, there are a lot of background apps and stuff like that, which made the processor, CPU and GPU, both to work hard and which produce a lot of heat. And that's the reason why the fan was spinning, okay? And I think the best operating system until now is Windows 10. So if there is any chance, try to use Windows 10 Pro. If there is not, then you can still keep Windows 11 but make sure you check the background apps if that is enabled, okay? So this is pretty simple. Um, uh, when I install Windows uh, 10 Pro, I used it in UEFI format, you know? To do UEFI format, what you should do, first thing you need to create your bootable Windows installer, not in MDF, in GPT. If you don't know how to create one, you can check the video link would be in the description, okay? Or you can just search how to enable USB boot for Dell XPS 15, whatever the model is, okay? I got plenty of videos in there. So after I installed, I'm gonna uh, open up many pages, I mean the browser, plus I'm not gonna render something, so that would make a lot of pressure in the background. You're gonna use the full RAM, okay? And I believe that would produce a lot of heat. Then I'm gonna put my microphone right next to the Dell logo, so it can capture the fan noise, you know. However, I done it and I was quite happy with the performance. The fan noise, speed, everything was normal, you know. And after a while, I used a couple of months and still that is okay, all right. So that's the thing. So what is the key fact here? As I said, that might be your many background apps especially if you do have some sort of heavy antivirus, give it a check how it is working, how the setup is. And also if you do have any video editing software, this and that, you know, and some sort of torrent application, give it a check, okay? And try to update your system uh, regardless of Windows 10 or 11. And at some point that should be fixed, you know. And also sometimes the RAM could faulty, okay? When any fault comes with the RAM, you're not going to see any display, okay? If you see the display, then you can presume the RAM is fine, you know. So those are the basic steps that you could do to reduce the fan noise, okay? And still, if it doesn't help, then what you should do, you can download some app, okay? It look like, let's say, CPU fan control app. If you search, you might going to find some of them you know definitely free of cost and then you can customize the fan noise okay and also in some bios there is the option how the fan should behave definitely press it here and i'm gonna cancel the noise cancellation so you can hear properly
All right, so the sound captured by my wireless microphone, Holy Lint, as you can see, this is seated right next to the cooling fan. Okay, that's why it seems the noise is too high, but technically, practically, the sound was normal. Okay, when you benchmark your laptop system, you know, obviously, it, it produced a lot of pressure to the GPU, CPU, you know, to check the performance and everything. Even after though, the speed was quite normal okay so i could blame the fan noise came from the actual overheating issues and why it was overheating two reason two facts one of them thermal paste dried up and the cpu and gpu fan were very dirty second one the operating system was running a lot of background apps and that's the reason combined this result okay so by the way it's all fine now Thank you for the long journey with me. It's almost 18 minutes long videos. And still, if you do have any question, make sure you leave it in the comment section. And don't forget to like and subscribe.